Hello friends, this video on solid states part 11 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So as we have told that crystal lattice are made of unit cells. And the crystal, the unit cells has parameters alpha, beta, gamma, a, b and c. So if you vary these parameters a, b and c and alpha, beta, gamma, you will get different varieties of unit cells, correct? Experimentally, it has been seen that there are only four different types of unit cells based on alpha, beta, gamma and ABC and they are called seven lattice system and their name is uh, monoclinic, triclinic, orthorhombic, rhombohedral, tetrahedral, hexagonal and cubic. So if you see this was the generic definition of unit cell. This is what we have discussed. We have A, B and C, alpha, beta, gamma. So if you vary this parameter, for example, in Q, Everything is same. A, B and C are same. Alpha, beta, gamma is same. So in cubic form, A is equal to B is equal to C and alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma. All are equal and this is equal to 9 degree actually. 9 degree. And you get something called cubic. In tetragonal, if A is equal to B but not equal to C, two sides are equal. This is A, let's suppose and this is A, but this is B. Two sides are equal, third side is not equal. Right? Let's see. So in that case, but the angles are equal. And they are 90. This is called tetragonal. In orthorhombic, all the sides are unequal. They are all une unequal sides. That is, A is not equal to B is not equal to C, but alpha is equal to beta is equal to gamma is equal to 90 degree. That is called orthorhombic. They also found something called monoclinic where sides are not equal. Sorry, A is not equal to B is not equal to C. Sides are not equal. When you talk about the angle, alpha, two angles are equal. And they are 90 degree. If you see alpha and beta, and they are two angles are equal. I can say alpha and beta 90 degree. And gamma is not equal to 120 degree. There is a monoclinic. Two angles are 90 degree and third angle is not 120 degree. Correct. Then we have something called hexagonal. In hexagonal everything is defined. What is defined? Two sides are equal. We have A here. This side is also A. Right. So that means two sides are equal. That is A is equal to B but third side is not equal. But angle is also defined. Two angles are 90 and one angle 120 you see so you can see that alpha is equal to alpha is equal to beta is equal to 90 degree and gamma is equal to 120 right you see all the angles are also defined in case of rhombohedral what we do is all the sides are equal a is equal to B is equal to C. All the angles are also equal. But they are not equal to 90 degree. This is like a cube. You take a cube and you just tilt the cube a little bit. Right? You apply some force in this direction. Maybe it will be tilted. You get wrong it. Then you have something called triclinic. In triclinic, all the sides are unequal. If you see. All the sides are mentioned ABC. All the angles are different. That's why you see all the angles are mentioned here. Right? Alpha is not equal to beta is not equal to gamma. And they are not even equal to 90 degree. So these seven systems are something which is found experimentally. So that is the structure of these unit cells. But the way the atoms are arranged in these unit cells, maybe as in some case the atoms are arranged only on the corners, in some case some ways atoms are arranged also in the center in some cases atoms are arranged in the face you don't know right so that is a different story altogether so that is a category so I'll, I'll pick only one unit cell now and we'll see that these unit cells also have various categories the first is the primitive cells in this case all the uh, constituent particles which you have that is ions molecules or atoms they are present only on the corners only on corners Correct. 
then we have center unit cells in center unit cells the constituent particles are present in the corner also somewhere else right somewhere else maybe inside the body uh, inside this uh, edges we don't know somewhere in the corner corner plus somewhere else also somewhere else also somewhere else too correct in this there are three types the one is the body centered in body centered the atoms or the constant particles are present in the corners plus center of the body and that's why the name body centered center of the body correct that is my body centered the next is face centered face centered corners plus all the face i showed half one because half is will be the part of another unit cell because there will be so many unit cell combined right so just for a clear view this is half shown here there will be full actually but uh, the part of this is only half so just for a better view i have shown the half uh, atoms here so they are shown uh, they are on the all this uh, four uh, or one two three four five six six uh, sides correct plus corner so center of each of the face so each six face plus corner so let's say center of each face because they are in the center of each six face then we have the last one called end centered so end centered center of any of the two opposite face maybe on these two face or these two face right like that or this two face the three possible options and that's why the name is a b or c it is in the a a phase or b phase or c phase so primitive is called by uh, letter p the body centered by letter i face centered by f and end centered either by a b or c depending on it is on the edge a or edge b or edge c right so they are the four different categories of unit cells thank you Visit examfear.com to watch more videos, attempt free online tests, get free study materials, find tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.